Uh, another condition that sometimes can raise a lot of unnecessary investigations uh, in form of biopsies and electron microscopy, while it's very, very common and very transient condition, it's called transient neonatal, neonatal postular uh, melanosis. You can see here, when you see this baby in the clinic, uh, a lot of differential diagnosis will cross your mind, like uh, herpes simplex infection, uh, shingles, um, uh, congenital pollus diseases, or even autoimmune um, uh, um, uh, uh, condition like uh, uh, pollus pemphigoid or chronic pollus disease of childhood. And so this is um, a quite um, a common condition. You usually is known also uh, transient neonatal postulosis, affects about 4% of the newborn infants, very common in Afro-Caribbean and Asians. It's again of unknown cause. And um, usually the postules and the papules arise on a normal skin. And this is a good clinical sign to reassure you that there is no underlying condition uh, uh, that I've just mentioned a few uh, seconds uh, ago. Uh, the postules and the um, blisters usually rupture leave behind crust that takes few days and heal by hyperpigmentation, which usually fades after a few weeks or months. Again, there is no need for any biopsies or uh, necessary investigations, and apart from using uh, moisturizer creams.